that's true. Is that right? She sippin' one wet and yeah, I swear it get her wetter. My loop but that's new, so my bottom stay is redder. No, I'm not a rat, but I'm all up on my channel. Just talk to your so I always start my pamper routine in the shower and the first thing that I like to add to my shower routine if I'm, you know, giving myself a little pamper is putting a hair mask and letting it sit in my hair for a couple minutes, which I usually don't have the time for. And while I'm waiting for my hair to soak all that in, I like to exfoliate my skin, which I also don't usually have the time for. This is a black salt skin scrub and I like to use this electric spinny brush with it. Exfoliating your skin is literally magic to it because you're getting rid of all the dead skin cells on the surface of it. So you're leaving your skin super smooth and you're getting rid of all the bacteria and dirt that's been collected in your pores so your skin's less likely to break out, even in your legs. And it also fastens the blood flow that go to your legs and your arms so you're less likely to get cellulite in those areas. After I'm done scrubbing, I like to wash off all the salt, especially this one because it does leave your legs a little bit black. And this usually takes around 3 to 4 minutes, so then I like to rinse out all the hair masks that's left in my hair. Once I'm done with my shower routine, I go ahead and start with my skincare. Since it is a spa day, I like to go all out and really care for my skin using a skincare set and this is the subscription box called BioClarity. The subscription box is totally plant based and super gentle on my skin and that's why I'm so obsessed with it. So the first step in the clear skin system is the cleanser which is my personal favorite out of the three. I have really sensitive skin so when I find a cleanser that doesn't break me out and it takes off all my makeup and dirt, I obsess over it. So I like to add a little bit on my exfoliating mitt which really gets under your skin and just cleanse my face with this. Before teaming up with them on this video, I tried this set out for two weeks straight just to see if I could get any actual results and my skin was literally glowing by the end of the two weeks and I was so impressed by it. I think what really got me is the fact that it's plant based because when I do use it, it makes me feel a little bit more conscious of what I am putting on my skin. After I'm all done with the cleanser, I just like to rinse it off and move on to step number two. The second step is the treatment gel, which I kind of have a like coincidental kind of gross story about. I don't know if you've ever done this, but you know when you squeeze your pores on your nose and these like white worm like things come out that are really disgusting, I'm sorry. I looked online how to get rid of those and it was like apply salicylic acid and I was like, okay, let me find that real quick. But then I saw that this product actually has that. So that's why I like to apply it around my nose area just to get rid of those things. I think the last product the Floralux is the coolest one because it has like this very interesting green color and if you want to know what that is it's what we learned in science class in fifth grade the thing that's in the plants chlorophyll and how cool is that because chlorophyll is supposed to turn like the sunlight into energy that's literally what this product does it has a bunch of antioxidants honestly pretty 10 out of 10 even though I kind of do look like Shrek a little bit but it goes away in like a minute or two I promise once your skin soaks it up the subscription box is only 30 bucks and I I have a 50% off coupon code in the description box and you can also add their other products to the box which is what I did this is the hydrate skin smoothie which is like a really good moisturizer you can subscribe to the subscription box using the link down below and I'm not just saying this because I teamed up with them I genuinely think this is a set that you guys would enjoy so once I'm done with my skincare routine I move on to some other fun things I like to hook up my phone to my speaker just to have some music playing in the background an essential part of my pamper routine is definitely teat Teat, teat whitening, I love it very much. I meant to say teeth whitening because this takes a good amount of time that I usually don't have. And <laughs> wow, that sounds sad. These are the Crest white strips. And sorry, I look really funny, but I feel like they work the best on my teeth. And I usually keep them on for around 30 minutes to like 45 minutes. They kind of like prevent you from speaking for a little, but it's okay. You're just relaxing in the meantime. Taking advantage of me not being able to do anything because I have, oh, okay, that happened. Teeth strips on my teeth. I like to also add in a face mask and just keep this on around the same amount of time. At this point, I have a sheet mask on, teeth whitening strips. I'm literally not capable of doing anything. So I like to take even more advantage of time and give myself a little bit of a manicure. And I just want to warn you beforehand, I'm really, really bad at painting my nails. Usually I get them done at like a nail salon. I mean, I guess they didn't turn out that bad. Once time has gone by, I like to take off my teeth strips and my sheet mask. And usually I like to rub in what's left of the sheet mask into my skin so we can soak it in better. And that's usually the last step of my pamper routine. 
Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed my pampers slash at home spa day routine, whatever you want to call it. You can check out BioClarity if you want to using the link down below. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys next Saturday. And I love you guys so much all the way to Pluto and back. Bye. All I want to do is lay up with you all day. All day. All day. Nothing else, nothing.